guys, welcome back to The Beautiful Diary. So today, as promised, I'm going to be doing another haul. Um, I've gone shopping to different places, I've gone to Ulta, I've gotten some stuff from online, I've gone to Forever 21, so I'm going to be showing you a bunch of different products that I've bought, and I hope you enjoy. Okay, so first I'm going to start off with eye makeup that I bought. Um, I've, saw, I've seen a lot of reviews for this product. And I really wanted a palette that had a range of different colors, but I didn't want to spend a lot of money because, yes, I would love to buy the MAC palette, but I know it's almost like $200 for just a limited amount of shadows that you can get. So I went with Coastal Scents, and I bought two of their palettes. Um, you can buy these palettes on CoastalScents.com. It'll be on the sidebar. I first bought the Coastal Scents um, 88 Original Palette, and it's just... Um, matte shadows. They're not shimmery, but they're gorgeous colors. You can see there's a range from beiges, oranges, pinks, purples, greens, brown, and blacks, which I really like that. And this palette has been um, a part of my Holiday Glam Greens makeup tutorial, so definitely worth buying. This one was 18 bucks, and then shipping and handling, I think it came out to 23 So I love that palette. And then my boyfriend decided to surprise me and get me the warm 88 Warm Palette, and this one's more new than the other one is, and I really like this one because I, I do like to do neutral colors a lot, and this one just had a variety of shadows as well. You have um, very nice warm whites and, and champagnes and beiges, and then you get some blues, some browns, some pinks and purples, and some oranges as well, and this one's just gorgeous, as you can tell. And this one was a little bit more. I think in total, the shipping and handling came out to 30 bucks. But if you want a nice palette, and this is great for anything that you would want to do, you can mix the two together to make a really nice color. Um, but if you want something nice that's not going to break, you know, the bank, I definitely recommend getting one of these. <clears throat> okay, so on to more beauty. Um, this is more for the face. I usually use... Um, like max shade stick that they have for foundation but I ran out and I just could not afford to spend like I think it's twenty eight dollars for it again because it runs out kind of easily for me because I like to put a lot on um, so I looked online and I found this um, brand of makeup is by Revlon and it's Color Stay Mineral Mousse and this one is light medium and it's SPF 20 and let me tell you this is like perfect if you like to use a MAC shade stick I believe I'm NC30, and this one just works amazingly. Like, if you can tell, there's no, you can, it covers so well. And it was really nice because it was only $11, and it came with a concealer as well. And it just matches the color perfectly, and you just apply this and this, and you're good to go. And it lasts for such a long time. I was so surprised for the price. It lasts for the whole day. All I need is a little powder on top and I'm good to go. So definitely recommend this one. Just their whole color stay collection is great. They also have liquid collection, um, a liquid brand of their makeup in the color stay, but I really don't like liquid. So this is perfect because it's a matte mousse and it's a little bit thicker and it just goes on very easily. The only thing I do have to say about this product is that you want to use your fingers and you want to put it on fast because it does dry and once it dries, obviously, you can't spread it out. So definitely, if you're looking for a product that is similar to the MAC Shade Stick, I would recommend this product. Okay. So then also for the face, um, I've been looking for a really good face wash because lately, or for a very long time, I've had uneven skin tone because um, in my family, we all have uh, a lot of redness to our faces and I wanted something that would kind of clear up that redness and I've tried different products but so far this one works really good and I have to, um, with this I can use less foundation and less stuff on my face because it works really good. Um, it is Olay Dual Action Cleanser and Toner and it has um, cucumber menthol so it has an interesting smell but it's a two-in-one foaming facial cleanser and it deep cleans and tones and I would say immediately after one week of using this, I definitely could tell that my skin looked better, I had less breakout, and it just felt it felt better as well. So I definitely recommend this. If you're looking for something, I have combination oily, so it's just right in here, and this really helps to take out the redness and just make it nice and smooth and similar colors on my face. So that's great. So again, Olay. I'll show you to you. Okay. 
So, um, I was pretty excited because I like to go out a lot and I was looking for a black clutch that was cute but small enough to go and take it out if I was going to a party or something like that and I could just hold it and I haven't been able to find one. Well, I had, um, like lately Victoria's Secret is giving out this secret rewards card where you get it and then you can scratch off or they scratch it off for you and tell you how much you can get like $10 off, $50 off, 100 um, or 500 and I ended up getting the $10 off but I was so happy because that's money anyways. So I went to Victoria's Secret and they had this special, I don't know if they still have it, I'm pretty sure they do, where you just spend $15 with any purchase. So what I ended up bu buying was a $7 eyeshadow, one of their little eyeshadow that it's like a little brush and you can, I showed it to you guys on another video. But anyways, I bought that and I came out to 7 bucks. and then I had two little rewards, excuse me, cards, so I bought this lovely for fifteen dollars this really cute clutch Victoria's Secret to be a symbol and it's so small and it's perfect it still has the tag on it because I haven't used it yet but more than just ha having this it comes with a bunch of different mini products inside and I'm going to show it to you but it's really nice and big and you can fit your makeup in it you can fit your phone in it I could probably fit anything I wanted in here so what it comes with is this scented body lotion and this one is sexy little things noir and I really like the smell and I've told you guys in other videos that it is very hard for me to wear any type of fragrance on my body because I do break out very easily but this scent is let me let me smell it again um it's very very light so it's easy for me to wear and I have not broken out with this and I'm so happy about that because I break out so easily so it um it is 30, one foot ounce, so you can, it's a nice size of the product, and it smells really good, and obviously if you wanted to buy it, you can get the bigger one. But it comes with this, um, it comes with a mirror, which I was really happy about, because I always do my makeup in the car when I'm waiting, and it comes with two different, see, that's my camera, and it comes with two different um, lenses, I guess, so you can look at it some more out, and then closer up on your face, so you can really work with your eye makeup or whatever you want to fix, touch up, really cute too. Um, it comes with a really nice lip gloss, and this one is Victoria's Secret Lip Gloss and Hottie, and this was also in my Glam Greens makeup tutorials, if you want to see what the color looks like, it's on that video. Um, and then it also comes with a rollerball um, fragrance, so that was, the other one was the body lotion, and this is more of a fragrance, a perfume, and this one is their new scent, Love Rocks, and I love the smell. It, it just is, it's a little bit stronger than the scented body lotion, that one's more mild and this one's um, a little bit more like fierce, but I really really like the scent and I'll just put it on small areas, I won't put it all over my body. That is one thing I want to talk about, I do not understand why girls put fragrance all over their bodies, it does not smell good, it is way too much and when you walk in a room, everyone should not be able to smell you from miles away. And I had that happen to me where I was somewhere and this girl walked into the room and all I smelled was candy and it was not good at all. So it should be a little bit more subtle, I think, personally. That's my personal opinion. But um, yes, I just apply this in, maybe on my um, wrist or behind my neck, something like that, behind my ears, and it works really nice. So that's this one, Love Rocks. And you can always check out these scents before you buy the um, beauty bag just to make sure you like it. Obviously, if you're not going to like what's in it, then... Unless you just want the purse, I wouldn't suggest buying it, but I really like it. And then finally, this was like the winner for me, why I really wanted to get it, but unfortunately I dropped it, so a little bit has fallen out. This is their eyeshadow, it's um, Silky Eyeshadow Gilded Fierce, and it's so pretty. It reminds me of a color from one of the MAC um, style black collections, because it's black, but it has gold little, gold colored specks in it. And it's really, really cute. I don't want to open it just because, like I said, I dropped it on the floor, so it's kind of falling out. But it's a really, really nice color. So that's everything that comes in the packaging of the bag. And it shows you there everything you get. And it's a $54 value. I don't know. I mean, who's going to really check that? But it's really, really cute. I definitely recommend it. If you want a black clutch, go get this one.